Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be looking at how to do these little winglets on the end of a wing. Now, I've seen many ways of people, how they've done them, but I believe this is probably the most simplest way um, that I've come up with um, doing these winglets like this. So let's go ahead and get started here. And what I'm gonna do is just create a wing Quick little profile. sketch use a plane at an angle Chris sketch on this plane here at top I don't know why that happened do that again Finish sketch. And now I'm going to sweep. And our wing is there. Now, going to create a sketch on this plane here. Make sure you have your 3D sketch on down here. Move this up. This over. Okay. Then another fit point spline back here. Move this. Look at this from the side here. Okay. 
And whatever shape, how thick or thin your winglet is, you'll adjust these until you get the shape that you need. And I want this to match this, but I don't want this to snap on like that. So I hold the control down, the control key. Now this here, I'm going to adjust this, so this comes out here. Same thing with the um, front here. And like I said, I'll just keep moving these around until I get a nice shape that I like. Then I'll move these down. Okay, that looks pretty good there. I'm going to go ahead and finish the sketch here. Then we come over here, create, and we're going to use a sweep again. This is the profile. This is the path. And this is the guide rail. And I'm going to keep these separate, so create a new body here, and click OK. And we have our winglet. Now, that is the easiest way I've come up with doing these winglets. It um, This is not hard to do, and if you have a, you know, the picture of it, you would just put it on a canvas over here and copy it from the front, the side, the side, and then the top. But like I've said, I've seen many ways how people have done these. And to me, this is probably the most simple way to do this. It's just sketch in 3D with the, um, the spline in 3D, and then just sweeping this um, shape here up to here. So we have that. And then you could even Let's go back here and edit this sketch here. Could even bring this closer in here. And you have that. And you can um, 
add color. Like how I did um, mine, the earlier one. And doing the wing tip or those winglets, it's just that simple. Just that simple. Now, another wing um, winglet tip um, shape I've seen, and you can do it like this. I'll show you real quick here. Just create a sketch on this plane here. And these, like I said, this is just a um, spline here. And this doesn't follow any really shape. But I've seen um, wing tips or winglet things similar to this. And you would finish sketch. Then you just use an extrude, extrude all of this. Remember how um, thick it needs to be. And make this also a new body. Click OK. Then you have your shape here on the end like that. We turn that off and turn the other one back on. And we have that wing tip. So doing wing tips are just that simple. But having them curve up like this, is, like I said, it's best, not best, but the easiest just to do them in 3D sketching and just turn your 3D sketching on and um, draw the lines out. And then use a sweep to sweep it um, like you saw me do there. So yeah. But anyway, that's going to do it for um, that. And if you have any questions about this or anything, go ahead and leave them down in the comments or contact me on my Facebook group or my Patreon site. And both are called Cat Bill Fly RC. And um, go ahead and join anyway each site. And if you have any questions, like I said, just go ahead and ask them there or down in the comments. And I do answer questions, and I like helping people. And there are a lot of good people on both of the sites over there that will help you as well as I will. So yeah, go over there and have a look. So if you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and um, subscribe. Also turn on the bell notification so you know a new video comes out and everything and you won't miss anything. So yeah, so that's going to do it for this video and we'll catch you in the next one. Subscribe for more.